Swamiji, Swamiji. After reaching the belly, okay, okay, I accept. You and your logical discussion, cheek, not I, but it's all Narayana did, okay. After it has come on my belly, who digests, Swamiji? Come on. Don't I digest? <laughs> Buddha, you don't digest. What? Now, even when the food has thus reached your belly, oh man, you are not fit to administer and manage your digestion. If digestion also is your job, <laughs> none of us will be available for any other work. Sorry, Swamiji, I am very busy. What are you doing? You see, the last two days I did not care for the red corpuscles and there are no red corpuscles. I am making red corpuscles. <laughs> and white corpuscles are gone down. You see? And my left arm, I never gave me, I mean, blood for the last two days and it is now drying up. So I have to know. I'm not like, I'm not. You see, last one month I was so busy, I could not make marrow, and so all the bones are now empty. <laughs> Think of how many different types of cells in the body. If all these are your responsibility, you have no time for anything else. I am very busy. You will be always at home, sitting on your chair. I am very busy. Why? Digesting. Assimilating, <laughs> absorbing, distributing. How? Oh, it's a huge job! See? Narayana says, you, I know you are not competent enough. Better. My dear Sunny, you are not fit for it. I will. Papa will do it. You keep on consuming. The rest all I will do it. Isn't it? Now see what are his duties. Aham, I, the Lord, Vaishwanaro Bhutva as the fire of digestion. Digestion is considered as a fire. Heat is necessary for digestion. That is why tummy cold I got. Meaning? In digestion I got in winter. Why tummy cold? In order to avoid the tummy cold that the British used to wear, Kabarbandi. Kabarbandi is not a Hindi word. It is a Hindi word, but it is in the Oxford Dictionary. Because the West took it up. Kabar, the, the, the waist. Bandi, binding. A long piece of narrow, long piece of wool. You turn it round and round your belly. Why? To keep the belly warm. So that even if you eat living pigs crawling rats, it'll get digested because of the warmth. That's I as the fire of digestion, I remain in all bodies. Plant, animal, and human. Even intelligent man cannot digest by himself. What about the animals and the plants? I, all, all sarva prani, in all living beings, sarva bhutani, all bhutas, all living beings, I, I mean, take shelter or work in the belly of all living beings. And what are my duties? <laughs> See that? Everyone who is employed must know all the duties. <laughs> I am a digestive part, therefore I have only to digest. No. Keep a record and account for it. Prana apana samayukta. Prana, whatever that you take in. Apana, all your excretions. Whatever you throw out, your prana and apana must be balanced. Then only your health will be. If you are constipated, eating will reduce. I don't feel like eating today. I am giving in a honey. 
I want only fruits today. Why? What is the matter? Aparna was not balanced. Supposing Aparna goes on. <laughs> that also is dangerous. Prana Aparna. Both the intake and the rejection or the outflow must be samayukta, balanced. So he has to keep account and keep it balanced every day like a bank. And how heartless you and I are. He is working three shifts. Because the daytime you continuously eat, that he has to do every night, night duty. To digest the whole lot. Till you fall asleep. You go on eating. Shamelessly giving him like a slave, heartless master of a slave, you give him work and he works. He, without complaint he works. And in the early morning, four o'clock, he just stretches his back a little. Abba, I have done it today. <laughs> there comes the breakfast. <laughs> Think. Samayukta Pachami Annam. I am the one in every one of you that digests Annam consumable food. <laughs> 